Hello, beautiful people. My name is M. Tommy of Peace Ark Ministry. It's a beautiful morning right here in Nigeria. It's a very sunny day, and I'm super happy to talk to you. <laughs> Thank you for always being part of my broadcast and always tuning to my TV. I love you so much. All right, so today I want to share something with you. Okay, Pastor, I want to share something with you. Um, that revelation I have. Uh, this is general, right? And the whole of churches, people will be fasting and praying for the new year. That will be done January, that will be done February and March, and the rest of it will do 50 days, 100 days, 70 days. And... But there's something you don't understand. In all you're getting, the says, get understanding. You must understand how spiritual things work. You don't fast because you feel like fasting, you don't fast because uh, you want to fast. There are some churches that were not doing all this fasting and prayer thing. But because this one have seen that church, that one have seen the other church, and everybody feels it's the right thing to do. So almost everybody right now, once it's January, they will start fasting and praying. I'm not saying it's not good to fast. I'm not saying it's not bad. It's, it's not good to pray. But when you pray and fast without revelation, it's a wasted effort. That's why many people have fasted and prayed for so long now without a result. We're still going to fast this year. I see go through the same thing you went through last year because you don't understand how spiritual things work. You can't prepare to attack your enemy when you're attacked already. You prepare to attack your enemy when he's not even away. Let me tell you something. If you are praying today and fasting this month or this year, that this year should be well, everything should be fine, and you know, there should be no attack, you're waging war against spiritual powers, principalities, and the rest. You are coming too late already. Because why you are busy praying and fasting, thinking you are fighting the devil? You are not fighting with anything. Those guys have won the fight over your race since last year. They have done. They, have, they, they were done with you since last year, since November. They were done with you completely. They have finished all their pressure, all their projection for the year. That finished last year. All what they're waiting for this year is result. New that is coming now this year to start waging war, to start fighting, to start running shows that you're not spiritual enough to understand that these guys were done with you last year. You're coming too late. Now let me give an example. No matter how strong our army is, no matter how powerful they are, if those armies are ambushed by the enemy, they'll be conquered by the enemy. What I mean by ambush is, if the enemy knows they are coming in next year or next month, they will start getting ready for you this month. They will take over everywhere. They know your route. They know where they're coming in from. And they will be there, first of all, to ambush you. They block your, uh, your, your, your back, your front, your sides. You have no way to run to because you that is coming now, you are coming now to ambush. New world have ambushed you already. That's exactly what has happened. These guys have taken over everywhere. They have, been, they, have, they have ambushed you already. So you that is coming now to start ambushing, to start fighting, they will kill all of you because you have been ambushed. So if you wanted to attack them, you wanted to wish war, you know that towards the end of the year, they always come to renew their covenants, their rituals for you and their family and the rest. You would have waged the war since last year. So that this year, you'll be here sitting down, giving God praise and looking at the result. The same way they're expecting the result, you too should be sitting there as result. That's why I give respect to the strategy of all nations. They don't work by sight. They don't work, they don't do what others are doing. They work by revelation. You will not hear any announcement that everyone should go and fast for the year for the 30 days or two. Nothing like that because they were done with all everything last year. So if you are praying this year, you want to take time to thank God, is to thank God not to wage war. You are not waging any war that if it's war, that means you have, you have been conquered already. You are done with you already. So try to understand spiritual things and how they work. It's very, very important. That's what the book says. In all you're getting, gets understanding. It is very, very important. So I'm not saying you should do fast and pray. But just know why you're fasting and praying. God bless you. Have a beautiful week ahead. You know, of course, I love you.